coming off a 28-14 loss at Minnesota State Mankato, but your defense had a pretty solid afternoon. You just talk about how that unit has been playing to this point of the season. Well, that group has continued to get better and better every week. It's It's been an area that we've really spent a lot of time focusing on in recruiting and in the offseason schematics. And I think the coaches have done a nice job putting game plans together, and I think our, our players are understanding the system better. I think they're playing hard, and really we've seen a, a, a real rise in play. And so I think that group has really become the backbone that we've been hanging our hat on and they've been keeping us in football games and so we got to continue to, to ride that group as, as as far as we can take them and hopefully continue to push forward and turn some of these close games into wins. Is there something that just clicked with that unit or did you just sense that this would be the year where it might just make that jump where it had been in the, the previous few years? Well we thought we were getting close to the tipping point where that, that unit would start to, to do what it's doing right now. I think having some veteran leadership of you know Aaron Bowl and Abe Rorick and, and Mike Strand really and some guys taking some real ownership of it through the summer and in the offseason I think they, they gained a, a deeper understanding and I think really set the bar of expectations higher uh, than what it's been and I think guys have risen their level of play to that. Another road game against a solid program at Minnesota Duluth this weekend. What are the challenges that the Bulldogs present? Well, they got a tremendous quarterback that, that can run, that can pass, that can really execute their offense well, and he, really, and he makes plays. And so when you've got a, a good quarterback with a good system and a good scheme by the coaches, certainly it's a tough team to beat. He's not going to turn the ball over. And so we're going to have to make sure that we play good defense. We try and give him some different looks, rattle him when we can, and, and try and capitalize on any uh, chances that we might get. I think offense we got to make sure that we get a little more consistency. But the big thing is we got to end long drives with points. We had a couple drives last week that were long drives that we just didn't come away with any points. And so um, that's something that's a point of emphasis for us, finishing in the red zone. And, and if we can put more points on the board and our defense keeps playing well, then, then we're going to have a good season.